Welcome all back to Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, Explorers of Sky. This is new a video, and I am Nyx. You didn't see it because I was playing on my own for a bit, but this is Chapter Five, uh, the first exploration. So that is that's exciting. New chapter. Um. I'm just going to do a save state real quick. There we go. Er, ahem. Everyone, listen up. I have an important announcement to make. Far to the northeast, and farther into its outermost reaches, there lies a place named Tree Shroud Forest. In Tree Shroud Forest, Time has apparently stopped. Huh? Eek! What did you just say? You're saying time stopped, hey, hey, hey? Yes, that's correct. Time has come to a standstill in Tree Shroud Force. The wind has stopped, the clouds are motionless. Dew drops on leaves won't fall. They just hang there, suspended. In Tree Shroud Force, time itself has truly stopped. T time has stopped? But, like, how could ha something like this so awful happen? It's unthinkable! Yes, the unthinkable has happened. Why has time stopped in Tree Shroud Forest? Well, it's because the Tree Shroud Forest's time gear was... Stolen. Huh? The time gear was stolen? That's what made time stop, hey hey hey. I've heard it was possible, but now it's really happened. I don't get it though. Why would anyone take a time here? Quiet, everyone! Officer Magnazone has already started an investigation. It's hard to believe that anyone would dare steal a time gear. But if one time gear can be stolen, the others may be also be in danger. The officer asked to be notified immediately if we notice any suspicious characters. So keep that in mind. Let us know if you notice anything. That is all. All right, everyone. Here's to another busy day of work. Hooray! Oh, you there. You two, come here. You've become quite good at your work. I'm impressed with your capture of Drowsy. That was very admirable. So, you all will finally be assigned a mission worthy of a proper exploration team. Really? Hooray! Let me see your wonder map. Nyx opens the wonder map. Treasure Town is here. And over here is where we would like you to investigate. See? There is a waterfall flowing here. By all appearances, it's just an ordinary waterfall. But we've received intelligence that the waterfall may conceal a secret. And that's where you come in. We want you to lot to investigate the waterfall and determine what's there. That's all. Do you understand what this mission entails? Good. All right. I'll leave you all to thoroughly investigate the waterfall. Huh? What's wrong? You're shivering. Are, are you all right? Yes, I'm okay. It's just the anticipation that's making me nervous. This will be the first time we get to do a real job as an exploration team. I'm getting a little worked up. Oh, I feel like I'm gonna burst from excitement! Let's do our best, Nyx! Alright, let's us go. And there is one more thing, I think. Oh, 
Nyx and Minx too. Huh? What's Jameko doing over there? Hello, what's going on here? I just started an assembly here. Today, in fact. Assembly? Yes. We're assembling your team. Have you ever considered adding members, Nick? Other members? Well, sure. It'd be cool to add other members. If there were more than just the two of us, it would sure help when we explore dungeons. Well then, you need to start recruiting members. Oh, how do we start? I'll just ring the friendship bell for you, Team Bluebell. Here goes! Hey -ya! Mecco ran the, rang the friendship bell. Now Team Bluebell has the power to recruit new members. Really? Yes! From now on, we'll battling Pokemon in dungeons. You may earn respect from some of them. And those Pokemon will then ask the gym in Team Bluebell. Once you have recruited a Pokemon, then you can bring it along with you on dungeon explorations. Try to Pokemon bring a Pokemon along, visit my assembly, then choose which member should join your team for the exploration. Always see me when you can want to assemble a team that includes recruits. Oh wow, thanks Chimeko. All right. I'm actually going to post a thing on Instagram real quick because I want you guys to choose what kind of Uh, names. Sorry, I'm getting really distracted by the Instagram post. Just one second. I'm going to have you guys choose what uh, names the new members get. Um, just one more second. I swear I'll cut this out in post. And we're back. Time to go to the new place. It's very exciting to get new members. Um... Oh! Spit this cafe! Fuck yeah! Huh? What's going on? There are stairs here. There's something written on the sign. Huh? What? Spit this cafe. A shop of hopes and dreams coming soon. Win big! It says. Looks like a new shop will be opening soon. But hopes and dreams? I wonder what kind of shop this will be. Let's come back after it's open and find out. Oh man, that's exciting. I love Spinda's Cafe. Alright. I am going to speed things up once I'm in the dungeon. But I will, you know go back to normal if we encounter any new Pokemon that want to join our team. So this is the waterfall that supposedly has a secret. Yo! That 
that water's coming down hard. Try getting close to the waterfall, Nyx. It's true. This is incredible. I can barely stand... Stay... Fuck. Motherfuck, shit, balls, ass, tits. I can barely stand near... Stay standing near this deluge. Wah! See? It's intense. If you were to fall under this waterfall, you'd probably be battered. I didn't think it would be pouring down this powerfully. Where should we even start looking? Hmm. Something seems familiar. It's that dizziness I felt before. happened again. I saw something. But what did I just see? Huh? What's the matter, Nyx? What? You had another vision? This time, you saw a lone Pokemon leap into this waterfall? And not only that, there's a hidden cave behind the waterfall? Hmm. But it looks out like that water is coming down really heavily. Imagine if there was actually a solid cliff wall behind that waterfall. Ouch. If we tried to jump through, we'd be pounded badly. Why would you say it like that, Minx? So, Nyx, what do you think, Nyx? Is there really something behind this waterfall? Are you really convinced that there's a cave there? Well, okay. I'm putting my faith in you, Nyx. Yes, I totally believe in you, Nyx. Yikes. Okay, I gotta be brave now. If I get scared and fall, fail to leap through it, I'll be no matter what I do. If I'm doing it, I have to do it without hesitating. Be brave. Be the bravest ever. Ready. Let's go, Nyx. Three, two, one, now. Wah! Yeah, whoa, whoa. What is this? Yes, it is a cave. You were right after all, Nyx. Let's go explore this cave, Nyx. Let's see what secrets it holds. Okay, speeding up now. I love you guys. All right, we got our first Pokemon. Um, this is a male Tangela, and we got the name suggestion. Um, let me see. I'm going to just Sneng. The name suggestion is Sneng from Jorb. Um, he didn't want this to actually be 
what I named the Pokemon, but it's too fucking late for that, Jorb! So this is a personal call-out for my friend, whose name is Jorbis. And now we have Sneng. Alright, now if we could only fucking find the exit to this goddamn place. Goddamn. Alright, speeding up again. Love you guys. Alright, we have our second new member of the team. Uh, I got a name suggestion from my partner, John. Um, his name is going to be Steven, I guess. I mean, it's a lot better than Sneng. Which... Sneng. I love Sneng. Alright, just gonna input the name real quick. And then I'm going to speed things back up. Motherfucker, I s fucked it up. I fucked it up. Okay. Now I'm going to input the name. And then speed things back up. Okay. Love you guys. See you in a quick bit. Alright, here we are to the end of the dungeon with our new friends, Sneng and Steven. Wow! Look at that, Nyx! Look at all the gems sparkling! Whoa! Look over there! It's a gigantic gem! Wow! I've never seen a gem this huge! This is an incredible treasure! Everyone will be amazed if we take this back! Minx tried to grab the giant gem. Ugh. 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 Nope, it's not budging. It's really stuck tight. Can you give it a try, Nyx? Nyx took over and tried to pull out the gigantic gem. Whoa! This really is stuck! It won't budge! Ugh. Ugh. Nope, no good. So you couldn't move it either, Nyx. But we can't just give up. If we try hard enough, we'll probably get some kind of result. I'm going to give it another go, Nyx. Nyx tried to pull out the gigantic gem again. Urgh! Urgh! Hmm. It's not budging one bit. Huh? Oh no. It's happening again. It's... But that was... Uh, uh, it's no good. I can't pull it out. Manx just happens to push the gigantic gem. Ah, fuck! 
Huh? What's going on? Oh god, it's a flood! Huh? What? Where are we? Hi, hi! Are you two okay? You plopped down from nowhere! Oh, you startled everyone! Where are we? This is the hot spring. A hot spring? Indeed, this is my hot spring. The hot spring works in wonders on tiled muscles and creaky joints. Many Pokemon visit here. Tell me, youngster, have you got a map? Map? Oh, if you mean our wonder map, yeah, we have one. Unfold it for me. There. There we are. This is the hot spring's location. Oh, I see. The waterfall is here, so... Hey, check this out, Nyx! The water carried us all the way over here! My goodness! Was the water that carried you all this way? What a long journey that must have been. Let the hot spring wa wash away your fatigue before you make your way home. Good idea. We'll do that. Thanks, everyone. Hmm. Let me see if I've got this all straight. Behind the waterfall, there is a cave. In the deepest part of the cave, there is a gigantic gem. When you pushed on the gem, it triggered a trap of some kind. And, surprisingly, you were flushed off to the distant hot spring. Is that the gist of your report? Yes, it's really disappointing that we couldn't bring the gem back. No, no, no! Emphatically no! This is a major discovery! Really? Undoubtedly! After all, the presence of the cave behind the waterfall, no one knew about that before now. Oh, I see, we made a discovery. When I had those dizzy spells, the shadow of that Pokemon I saw. That shape. I've seen that shape before. That shape, there's no mistaking it. That was Wigglytuff. Your waterfall discovery is just amazing. The guildmaster must be told. What? What's wrong, Nyx? Huh? You're saying Wigglytuff may have been at that waterfall before? No, no, no! Emphatically, no! That's inconceivable! If that were so, the Guildmaster wouldn't have ordered you to investigate the place, right? Hmm. However, since you insist, I will confirm it with the Guildmaster. Hmm. But why would they want to spoil their own discovery? How strange. I should be used to it by now. These apprentices are yet another strange crew, aren't they? What was that, Shadot? What? Oh, nothing, nothing, nothing at all! Anyway, I will go confirm what you told me with the Guildmaster. Please wait here. How, so how did it go? When I asked the Guildmaster, he mulled it over for a bit, and then he said... Oh, memories! Sweet memories! You da. Then he danced around a bit, and then he said, Yes, yes! When I think hard, maybe I did go there once. And that's just what the Guildmaster said. To sum it up, it's just as Nick's expected. Suspected. Those are completely different words. He has indeed already been to the Waterfall Cave. Oh, okay. 
That's kind of disappointing. We really thought we'd discovered a new place. I wish Wrigley Puff had told us right from the start. The Guildmaster can be rather, uh, erratic at times. Even I can't fathom what goes on in his head. Well, that's too bad for you. Nevertheless, I shall expect your best effort tomorrow. Urgh. Nerfle slurp, sniffle slurp, etc., etc. Today was exhausting. I should get to sleep early. <sighs> we went through a lot today. But you know what? It was incredibly fun for me. Sure, there was that huge letdown. But it was our first exploration. I thought I was going to explode from excitement and anticipation the whole time. It made me realize I made the right decision in joining an exploration team. One day I'm sure I'll solve the secret of my relic fragment. That's the dream I have. If it ever came true, I'd surely faint from ha sheer happiness. <laughs> But seriously, thanks. I can explore because of you, Nyx. Yes. Be brave. Be the bravest ever. I'm the biggest chicken around, and even I managed to work up the courage. And it was all because you were there with me, Nyx. Seriously, Nyx, thanks. Oh yeah! You know, I was thinking. I noticed something about your dizzy spells, Nyx. You always seem to be touching something when they happen. Come to think of it, Manx is right. When I heard Azuril scream. And that other time. And when we were exploring Waterfall Cave. It's... it's true. It was always after touching something. That's when I get those dizzy spells. When I touch something, I see something connected to it, right? There's one more thing. When we rescued Azuro, you had a vision of the future. But this time, you saw Wigglytuff going into the cave, right? So that means... This time, you saw an event that occurred in the past. That's true. In other words, Nyx... If you touch something, you see it's past or future. You must have so that kind of special ability. This could be something totally incredible. You could use it in a lot of ways. Not just for exploring, either! The ability could be used for many useful things. It's fantastic, Nyx! Well, yeah, I guess that's true. But that doesn't mean I always get a vision every time I touch something. It would be useful if I could have visions when I wanted, but... Hey, you two. The Guildmaster wants to see you right away. Guildmaster, I've brought you Team Bluebell! Guildmaster? Guildmaster? Hiya! Your team went to a what today? Yes, it's a what a what! But don't worry, I'm keeping watch on your activities. I should tell you why I called you in here. We're planning on to mount a full expedition soon. An expedition? Yes, the guild will go explore somewhere f far away. It's much harder than exploring our nearby area. That's why we need to prepare for the big trip properly. We carefully choose which guild members to go on the expedition. Really? Usually, we would never ever consider rookies to be expedition members. But you two are working so very hard. That's why we're making a special exception this time. We decided to exclude you in the list of candidates for the expedition. 
<laughs> John is just glaring at me and covering their ears. I am so sorry. Really? Now, now. You haven't been chosen as expedition members yet. There is still time before we set out on the expedition. If you fail to do good work before then, you cannot be expected to be selected for the expedition. I'm sure two of you two can do it. Try hard! Yes! An expedition, isn't it fantastic, Nyx? My heart is pounding all of a sudden. Let's try our best and make sure we get picked for the expedition. Yeah! Chapter 6, Team Skull. Ah, fuck, I'm up. I fucking hate these motherfuckers. They can go eat a uh, apple. And they will. Alright, that's all I have for you today, my lovelies. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Peace.